Hi, my name is Erin Olson, Biltmore Insurance in Loganville, Georgia. And we're here today to talk to you about liability limits on your auto insurance. The best resource to determine what liability limits you should buy is your independent agent. Discuss all of your financial information as far as your assets go with your agent so he can help you determine what limits you will need. Remember that the cheapest isn't always the best, the lowest isn't the best, you have to protect your assets. In the event of an accident, you are responsible for every bit of damage that you create, whether it's from an injury to the other driver or the damage to their vehicle. And you want to have enough insurance to cover all those expenses. If you don't, the insurance will pay the limits of the policy that you've purchased and you will have to pay out of your pocket for the difference. The only time that that doesn't happen is when you have no assets and there's nothing that the other party can gain from you by taking you to court. So make sure that you protect your home and all the things that you've worked so hard for and buy the liability limits that are needed to protect those valuable assets. In the event that your assets go over the standard limits that are offered, you can buy an umbrella policy that will be bought in layers of millions. So if you have the net worth of over a million dollars, you want to make sure that you've bought that umbrella to protect those assets that you've worked so, so hard for. Once again, my name is Erin Olson, Biltmore Insurance in Loganville, Georgia, and that's how to determine what liability limits you buy on your auto policy. <laughs>